Good Monday afternoon to you. I'm Storm Search 7 meteorologist Brian James. We have some changes coming up in the forecast over the next few days. Things aren't going to change that much. At least it's going to be fairly warm for us tomorrow and also on Wednesday. But by Thursday, well, that's when things start to get a little bit more interesting. I wanted to show you this is one of our computer models that we use to forecast the weather. And by Thursday morning, uh, you can see a pretty good push of some stronger northerly winds working their way into the western parts of the Oklahoma Panhandle and northeastern New Mexico, far northwestern parts of the Texas panhandle. Uh, that's a cold front that's going to be making its way down toward the south as we head through the day on Thursday. And by Thursday around noon, you can see that cold front has made its way uh, pretty far down to the south. You can see the strong north winds in the wake of that front definitely pushing their way down toward the south. But as we head through Thursday, yeah, a cooler day, a windy day. Temperatures may only be in around the 60 degree mark as we head through the afternoon. But that's just the first front to come in. There's another one set to arrive late in the day on Friday. We're going to advance to about Friday afternoon. And if you look, you can see that there is another push of some stronger northeast to easterly winds uh, right about in here or so. And that's a backdoor cold front that's going to be pushing in from the northeast and working back toward the southwest. And as that front does drop down toward the south, it's going to get quite a bit colder around here. As a matter of fact, as we go through Friday night and through the day on Saturday and also on Sunday, now this is Saturday around 1 o'clock in the afternoon. And uh, check out the temperatures. Only in the 40s to around 50 degrees for eastern New Mexico and most of the Texas panhandle. So it is going to be a chilly afternoon. Winds are going to be there, but it looks like the winds will drop off as we head through the afternoon but it will still stay rather chilly around here on Sunday as well. And first thing Sunday morning, there might be a couple of spots that have temperatures pretty close to the freezing mark, especially back toward the northwest and west. Now, it does look like we are going to have some cloud cover around. That would help us stay a little bit warmer, but just keep in mind, it looks like we're going to have a pretty nasty blast of late fall, almost early winter type weather around here by this weekend. More on the forecast coming up on Pro News 7 at 5, 6, and 10. Hope you'll join us.